What is up, my riders? So I was gonna do a video today, basically just showing you guys what I think happened with my turbo, but also kind of just putting that out there that is for sale now if someone wants to get it and rebuild it. But I do have my own ideas on what happened. So without further ado, I'm gonna set up the tripod so that I can show you guys around the turbo and just clarify what I think happened with everything. I'm also selling JB4 as well, which is a tune that you can throw on that's a piggyback and make JB4 for almost every single Volkswagen uh, available. But this will be for the Gen 3 GLI 2013.5 and up. So without further ado, let's get started. So I just want to clarify, this is completely unrelated. Cap popped off and the spring got damaged with that wastegate actuator when I was taking it off. Fine, it just needs a new wastegate actuator. It was fine before I took it out. Now, if you guys can see in here, not really, but there isn't really much carbon buildup. On this side, you can see where the oil was caked. My guess is either the oil seal went or there was an issue where oil was getting in somehow, which I, I'm not sure completely with these turbos on the internals, but uh, it was burning oil really bad. That's why I was seeing white smoke. That's why I was actually not being able to burp the system because for some reason I am guessing the coolant and the oil crossed paths on the inside and plugged it up. That's the only, that's the only way that I can justify and, and think of why it wouldn't burp the coolant system. Show you guys a close up more on that uh, just so you guys can see the channels. I think it needs to get torn apart, which isn't that hard. There's uh, this V-band that comes off um, and you can take both sides. I don't know how to do it and I already pulled the turbo. I'm gonna just get a new one. I'm not gonna mess around with this one anymore, but I'm going to be selling this for $300 starting out um, and that's OBO. I will slowly probably have to lower it. All right, as you guys can see in there, it's weird. It doesn't look like anything is damaged. That is why I suspect that it is uh, a seal on the inside that I can't see. That is the drain. The only other thing that I can think of, guys, is I did have tight space on the inside and I did need a better hose for the oil drain. And I feel like it was slightly clogged maybe, uh, backed up just because of how it was draining. Um, there was a kink in the hose that drains it back into the block. That could have been residual oil in the turbo for too long, and then it could have leaked. I don't know. It's one of those two for sure. As you guys can see here, other than it needing a good cleaning, and there's no play. Now watch as I spin it on the other side. freely there's no play so what I'm going to be saying right here is if you're in the market for an is 20 swap you want to make decent power I was at least making what a GTI full bolt-on was making definitely definitely get a hold of this turbo you still can if you guys have any questions on it or if you're part of uh, the gen 3 army you guys have any questions with the swap for the GLI uh, I can guide you guys through it especially if you end up taking this home but um yeah i'm gonna be asking 300 we'll see where that goes make me offers through my social i'll leave the social down below and i also have the jb4 i'm going to be going a different route for software um i feel like now that this has happened it's just time and uh the next turbo that i plan on getting is a is 38 plus so uh it's made by hpa i'll show it on screen here but it's capable essentially they say of 450 I would probably be okay with 400 and I don't plan on pushing my car anymore. I, I'm looking for more reliability out of it, but I still want to go fast, if that makes sense. Uh, the car is fully paid off and it, it's my baby. And now that I realize that I don't have a car and uh, the turbo's out and having to pull all that and everything, just makes you realize how much you take for granted when you don't have a car. <laughs> so uh, hopefully someone snags this up and you guys can help out that way so that I can get into a new turbo sooner 
Um, but yeah, I love you guys. Make sure to be happy, stress less. I'll see you in the next one. As always, hope you guys enjoyed this video. I love you.